It came from Xbox Live. Hello and welcome everyone to episode 9 of It Came From Xbox Live. I'm your host, Maxwell McBargains, and with me on the big red couch today is Pete Mead and Brown. Pete, thank you for joining us. Hi. <laughs> Glad to see you bringing the energy today, Pete. Really appreciate it. You ready to jump some indie games? Uh, let's do it. Yeah, okay, let's do it. Uh, There's the real Silver Dollar loading screen. Thank you, Silver Dollar. So many gems you brought us. This one, way, way too many people have been asking for, so we're finally going to do it. Let's try not to fart. Pete Brown, you look excited about this one. There's those, what are those noxious fumes? Are those supposed to be farts? <laughs> I think those, that is, that's actually a foul chemical reaction that occurs within a person's body. You need to go to the doctor if that's what it looks like. <laughs> I know, if you're farting out like green noxious, if it's visible, if the farts are visible, and you've got a you've got God. a situation. Okay. If, they're, if they're dense and low hanging too, <laughs> that, that's even worse. I have to work tomorrow. So this is a game about holding down buttons. Oh yeah. Drinks and holding in farts. And holding in farts. Sure. You want to obviously hold down the button oh, God, when it appears and then release on it when it starts to blink Can like I that. Get you if you wait too long, in either so case, you presumably you, uh, <laughs> you will you will have a bit of an accident. That make dress? a bit of a fool of yourself. <laughs> Oh, I'm a nurse oh, at the hospital. So in later sure. levels, like as you'll you'll start to see, maybe not in this one. Cause it's a bit of a joke at the first the one, time. but it'll start like the whole screen will just be. Fi oh no! The whole oh, no. screen will just be filled so with buttons that all start to go off at different times, like and you really have to know your lefts from your rights. I didn't realize how bad I am. <laughs> That's challenging. At left and at left and right recognition. Oh, no. That's asking a lot of you. I know that when I sat down to play this game. <laughs> Here, I'll, I'll go ahead and botch a couple completely on accident. So as you can see, yeah, as you as you mess it up, the uh, the fumes, the fumes, they start to rise. They look like violent fights. I know. He's like the poor boy's gonna hurt himself. Do you ever have to change your underwear? I have to get a new set of. Sh I think if you, <laughs> I think if you burn the bar completely <laughs> down to the bottom, yeah. <laughs> I like how everyone looks extremely nervous and like. That's because they all like alert. The well, I mean, do you think? Like, do you think like? So are sorry. you trying I to control one character and prevent them so from farting, or is it like? Is this a three-person fart royale else? that's going on right now? No, three pronged. Like yeah, and fart. everybody's <laughs> just like trying to hold it in and be super polite. <laughs> So, so Maybe sorry. if one person farted, they would you all feel more comfortable. I know, this is like a sick form of like socially accepted I torture that we have going on in today's modern society. This is actually a multiplayer yeah. game, like you're online right now. Just <laughs> back and forth like or it's that. just like, look, you if you need to let it rip that badly, <laughs> you could, you could, hurt, you could seriously hurt organs inside of your body, I'm sure. How was your meal? Seriously, you're going to do that here? Do you want some more water? I like how the fumes, they also never completely go away. Oh, wait, we got... They're always just like... Just hovering down there at the bottom slowly. See, the movie, movie theater is almost the best place to fart. Really? Well, I was gonna, during like, I was sound gonna, effect? Before we get to that, though, what is, like, least acceptable? Like, what is, what is the danger zone? I would say funeral. I would say funeral. Funeral's good. Like sometimes but you need, you know, people need to laugh. Yeah. yeah. I can it might be a little sometimes too serious. You need to break the tension. Break the tension a little, a little bit. Did you remember to yeah. I'm not big on popcorn. <laughs> You're a mess right now. Oh, I'm, okay. I'm watching you just. <laughs> Look, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead. It's all, we're going into the oh, red zone. Oh god. Oh god, we ruined. Oh, no, stop I it, go away. I wanna see the you fail screen. Well, I guess it's Next the high score screen. Mm. That makes me feel better about myself. Fire, so explode. I'm so dumb with this game. All right, what's next? I've done enough trying not to farting. So this game released. Oh, it says it down there in the corner. Released on Windows Phone devices. <laughs> um, not sure when that occurred, but it was also released on Xblig, just like last weekend, I think. So, or could be maybe maybe last last weekend, depending on when this goes up. So fresh meat is what you're saying. Yeah, fresh meat. Start back here a little before I played a little bit of it. But uh, this game, kind of exactly what it sounds like. So, whoop, you play this sort of nice little stopwatch looking device, and what you want to do is toss yourself through these maps using the different environmental obstacles. Oh, wait, I'm swinging the wrong way. There we go. Using the different environmental effects to get on these different. No. So no. How much control do you have over the guy when he's swinging? Like, can you just like give him momentum one way or the other? Yes. So by using the the left. Okay, I gotta slow down a little bit here because that is the exit point that you're looking at right there. Little here. By using the left and right triggers. Gotcha. There we go. Ease it in. You can uh, you can add force to the swing. 
So if you want to swing to the left, hit the left trigger. If you want to swing to the right, hit the right trigger. I think you can also use the D-pad and maybe like the left and right buttons as well. So you have options. And so you can increase momentum or you can do it sort of in the reverse of how we swing in order to, whoa, in order to slow him down. One would assume. One would assume. Oh, a little too much momentum on that one. These screens obviously control or give you a, a little bit of a boost one way or another. These ones, since the lines are moving up, they make your guy move up. Don't think I had quite enough energy on that. Let's see if I can swing it around a little bit. Here we go. This is going to be the big one right here. Here we go. Here we go. Get up there. Get up. Oh, no. Oh, no. He's totally swinging the wrong way. No. No. Oh. Thankfully, the checkpoint system is, is pretty kind. Phew. Oh, I think we got it this time. There we go. There we go. Get it over there. Pop that one. And swing it. Oh, oh. really? Really? Oh, no. <laughs> okay. Okay. That didn't happen. Do over. Is it wrong that every cloud I'm looking at, I just imagine as a fart? <laughs> <laughs> it's gotten into your mind, it Peter. It's seeped into my brain. Oh, good. Oh, actually, something that is completely not related to this game that we were going to talk about during that other game. You were talking about the fart monopoly. Conspiracy. Oh yeah, so like I assume that there's a guy that like, whenever there's a new software market that opens up, he's like, oh, I gotta release all my fart apps real quick. I know, because remember like, iPhone's, oh, gotta get you, gotta get your fart apps. Yeah, so I'm like, oh. million, 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 million Seriously, years. yeah, just like there's like a bodily function software group out there that just reigns supreme over the disgusting market. <laughs> oh. And I'm jealous, because that, you're probably that, making that, a pretty penny, a pretty stinky been penny. That could have been, you could have been. It still penny. can be me. The Bill Gates of farts. <laughs> Unfortunately, I think the game is only the 14 levels, um, but there is like a a harder difficulty that unlocks. What? After, oh, what? Hey, what? Hey, what? What happened? What? Oh. oh, I have to go back. That's, okay. that's what it was. Oh. That's what we call original design. Whoa, I guess, okay, that might have been a shortcut or it might have been a horrible <laughs> mistake. I guess we're about to find out. Oh, no, no, uh, no, no! <laughs> oh. You fell in the red fire. I did. <laughs> Things apart now. Don't blame me. <laughs> okay, here we go. 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 You only blame yourself. Oh, okay. there the elevator go. just wasn't gonna kick on there. It's like, well, just stuck. Uh, <laughs> good job, asshole. All right. So All right, well, what, what's that next? was Pendelosos, and here we are. This game attempting to tackle one of life's most difficult questions, I would say. Who is God? Who is God? <laughs> and here is where you make your choice. Right here, this is the whole game. You just pick one and go with it. Wrong. <laughs> yeah, it would be great. You pick one, just big screen says wrong, and it just kicks you back out to the menu. I think this game has an agenda. I'm not, I'm not too sure, but. Press A, use A button to boost. That's all the instructions. Use a button. Which, use a button. Which button? Just a button. A button. Where's the A button? Oh, uh, so this is like that game. Oh, God. Uh, doodle jump. I guess that's the name. Is it called Doodle Jump? There's, I've not heard of Doodle Jump. Doodle Jump, it's like an iPhone game, I'm, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. I forget if that's the proper name, but yeah, this is a similar concept, but actually looks more interesting, Balls. if you ask me. Fell down. Okay, so from, from what I understand, talk about a game where you don't want to play and talk the same Talk about time. balls. You, uh, you bounce on the little ye the yellow pads, obviously, and you want to collect stars, because stars allow you to do super jump, just like that. Super jump. They allow you to be a better god. Yeah, they allow you to they increase your, your godliness. And the purple ones, they disappear after you touch them. Like this one, whoop, gone. And you just want to, I'm not sure if there's actually an end. Maybe I'm just, maybe, perhaps I am a weak god. And so <laughs> all these times that I've sat down to play it, I just haven't gotten far enough to uh, reach an actual end point, but yeah. I played this game for a while without. Oh man, bonus star area. This is the best. And I haven't reached like the top. Yeah. Which maybe that, maybe that in itself. Oh uh, yeah, I would assume. supposed to say something. <laughs> about the, the constant straw. No! 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 Yeah. It's like building the Tower of Babel, man. Ah, uh, and then and then the inevitable collapse. Look at all their fine props. Bunker Buster. Hmm. Heyo. Nice little theme there in the last Oh, Platformance. A couple of people re recommended that game. Yeah. We might have to take a look at it. But not this time. Bada boop. Boop. All right, folks. So that's just about going to do it for us. As always, if you have any weird, bizarre, wacky Xbox Live mini games that you want to see us demonstrate for you on the show, 
please feel free to leave them in the comment section below and I will take a look at them. But until next week, I'm your host, Maxwell McBargans. I am Peter Brown. There you go. As always. <laughs> and we're saying see you next time. Bye. It came from Xbox Live.